feel like most people are motivated to get out of bed to drink their coffee, but I'm motivated to get out of bed to eat my gummy vitamins <laughs> because I am an adult baby. Also coffee, which we're about to make, so it's the best of both worlds. It's too early. Hey, ice. This is the lineup. This stuff is so good. Tastes like cereal milk. And then some stevia. Good morning guys. I am taking you through my morning routine in quarantine while I work from home. Nothing really has changed from like months ago because I work from home anyway. Um, and I'm really fortunate to be able to do that and create my own hours. After I've had my morning coffee and checked my emails for any urgent notifications, posted on social, etc., etc., it's time for my morning workout, which takes place in my living room. <laughs> I've been going on a lot of bike rides, runs, and walks over quarantine, and there's a little gym in my apartment that's still open, but I've actually been loving Raimi's workouts. Raimi and her boyfriend Nate do workouts on Instagram live at 9 a.m. every single day, and it has been such a game changer for me. I feel like these are workouts that I would never put myself through normally, which is why I'm seeing and feeling such incredible results. Like I literally feel like my posture and flexibility have improved since starting their workout programs. And it's free guys. Like the fact that they're doing this every single day, like voluntarily and for free is mind blowing to me. So you should totally go check it out. Post-workout, this is my second coffee. <laughs> I was not planning on doing this, but my bangs are overgrown and really bothering me. So before I got into my shower, I'm gonna trim them a bit. I trimmed them a little over a month ago. I always had like curtain bangs, but I just went for like the, the full thing. And I actually love how they look. So I'm just gonna trim them a bit. And how you do this, how I saw it on TikTok, gather the bangs and then twist them. And I don't have shears proper shears. These are literally arts and crafts scissors, but that's all I have. And I'm gonna trim. Just straight across. See what the length's at. They could be shorter. And then you just kind of repeat that process. But yeah, I was definitely not planning on doing that in my quarantine morning routine, but here we are. And like trim it up a little. Then I have these side pieces and I'm gonna trim these a little bit. Honestly, like I'm not, I don't think it's gonna be perfect, but so much better I can actually see. Then here's what I learned. Let me, one second, I'm gonna grab your straightener and straighten them a little bit straight. But then what I learned is you twist it and it gives this really cool bouncy like 80s look except because um, I have like two day hair right now or even three day hair. It's not as like um, bouncy as it would be if it was just washed. To be honest, I think this could be even a little shorter. <laughs> Literally like no rhyme or reason. It's just whatever you think looks good. Yeah, I think it looks really good. <laughs> morning, it's my morning routine. Here's it all together. Although man, I gotta trim these next. That's a project for another day. Yeah. I wanna show you my hair. Huh? I wanna show you my hair. What do you think? It looks great. Good job. I gave it a little trim. Oh, I've got a piece there. Yeah, I trimmed that. Oh, I like how blonde it looks. Okay. I won't bother you now. You ain't. <laughs> I just got dressed. Dressed. I'm in super comfy loungewear. I do like to change <laughs> throughout the day. Um, it just helps like break up the time and helps me feel more productive when I'm looking better i guess so i do try to have somewhat of like a put together outfit I'm trying to figure out what little earrings i want i'm gonna go with these little stars um but yeah i uh, for the rest of the day so it's what time is it now it's 10 30. so i'm gonna get ready just a little bit and i thought i'd show you guys kind of what what i do right now as far as like makeup goes um i'm really trying to give my skin a break and i I actually really like how it looks, um, how my skin's been looking recently. So I don't really put that much makeup on. I really just put highlighter on and mascara. Also for some reason, like I almost prefer how I look without a full face of makeup. The highlighter that I love is this Benefit Cookie Highlighter. And I put this on my nose. 
Cupid's bow cheekbones. Then I just put on this Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara and that's like pretty much all I've been doing. That's my makeup. And then as for my hair, I don't usually put any heat on it other than my bangs. And as I mentioned, I really need to trim my hair. So I typically just leave it down. Honestly, like throughout the day, I just get really annoyed by it because it's so long. And so I'll usually put it back like this, grab a, flo a froggy clip, and I'll just put my hair like this. <laughs> or what I just had on, which is like, just like that. It's just kind of easier to like not have my hair in my face all the time, you know? And I usually just leave it there for a while. And like the only time I really need my hair down is if I'm filming self tapes or want to like take some photos or something. Cause it's like, what's the point? Like in styling it, time to eat. <laughs> I overcooked my egg. I usually have a protein shake right after my workout, but today I wanted to do something a little bit different. And I think I'm gonna put a little bit of balsamic glaze on top. Mmm, needs a little hot sauce too. <laughs> I like to think of myself as like a one bite wonder where like every single bite needs to be perfect. So I tend to have a lot of different like sauces and seasonings and stuff. I'm putting a little bit of buffalo sauce on here. That was not a little bit, but I'll take it. <laughs> okay, maybe don't add that on. I typically start my workday around 11 a.m. just to give myself some sort of structure here because if I didn't have it, then I would just be working around the clock, which is not healthy. I try my best to time block throughout the day because it just helps me maintain this structure and, and keep boundaries in check. So whether it's for my clients or for me, my YouTube channel, acting, lunch. I seriously try to time block everything because it just helps keep that structure. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little morning routine and quarantine slash work from home. I do have another video that I'll link in the description box all about my tips for working from home because I know it could be a little bit tricky and I'm really fortunate that I still have a job during this time. I know a lot of people lost their jobs and so my heart is going out for you. But for those of you who are working from home and are still trying to get a hang of it, I do have some really great tips that I implement every single day that weren't mentioned in this video and I'll leave it in the description. Also, what do we think guys? I got a new camera with a mic. Let me know what you think and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.